What's up guys, I'm Rasim from rasmartech.com and this is another tutorial in Java programming. Now in this class I'm going to show you guys how to use the different numeric literals. So let's get started. A numeric literal is a numeric data type you assign a value or a variable. So there are different types. We've learned one of them already. I've showed you guys how to use integer, INT. So to declare an integer we type in INT, right? We hit space. We got to give our variable a name. So I'll call this variable red. We hit space, we gotta type in this equal symbol here, right? We hit space, then we gotta give this variable a value. Since it's an integer, it cannot have a decimal place. It has to be a whole number. So I'm gonna give it a value of, let's say, 45. And uh, we end it with a semicolon. Since it's a statement, we have to end all statements with semicolon. So this is our first numeric literal. It's an integer. We're declaring an integer, with, which we called red, and we give it a value of 45. So let's print this out on the screen here so i'm going to use the system that out that print line uh, statement so we're going to type capital s y s t e m dot out dot print l n open and close parentheses and end it with a semicolon right now we want to print out our, our integer here and uh the, the variable name is red so we're going to type in red in between these open and close parentheses because we want the value of this uh, variable to print out on the screen, right? So I'm gonna hit play here and the value of this integer should print out on the screen. And it did, it printed out 45. But since this is a integer, right? It, it has a limitations. You can only assign certain value from, a, it has a range. So I'll show you the range right now. With integer types here, it, it can only be between this range from negative Two one four seven four eight three six four eight two positive two one four seven four eight three six four eight. Now, if it's greater than this number here, the program will get an error message. So let me show you guys here. I'm going to copy this here. Let's copy this number here. Let's open up Eclipse again here. So I'm going to minimize this. So now let's replace this integer value here, right? Let's hit paste here, and uh, let's add one. Let's make this a nine instead of eight. So let's hit play, and as you can see, I got an error because the, the, the value is too great for an integer data type. So if we wanted to declare a variable with this value here, we can use a different numeric literal. It's called long. We have to start off by replacing int with long. Then at the end of the value, we type in L, right? So now when I hit play, and as you can see, it printed out the value on the screen. Let's say we wanted to uh, print out a value with a decimal point. We can use another numeric literal, it's called double. So we have to type in D-O-U-B-L-E, right? Then we have to replace the value with a decimal point. So 2.5 is a decimal point here. So once I hit play, it should print out 2.5, and it did. Now, let's say we try to uh, declare a variable using the INT, the integer uh, literal type, and let's give it a value with a decimal point. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna hit play here, and as you can see, we got an error. So if you wanna declare a variable with a decimal point, you have to use double here. So we have to type in double, hit space, type in our variable name or the variable name you wanna give it, hit space, equal symbol, then the value with the decimal point and end it with a semicolon. So that's pretty much it. If you guys like this video, please give me a like. If you want more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. I'm Rasim from RossmerTech.com and thanks for watching.